UK Sports and the PGA Tour are delighted to bring you the season-long race for the FedEx Cup. Today's coverage of the Valspar Championship is about to begin. Pleased you could join us for this second round action. I'm Luke Elvey alongside Rich Beam and this player starts their round in the lead. How should they approach today? It's right now the game plan is working, but they still have to go out there and play off the front foot, play on offense, and not worry about who's chasing them. Looking forward to this, Rich. Let's get into the action. Let's see what kind of tone he sets for himself today. Good shot there, Beamer. And what are we looking at here, Henny? Setting up here from about 200 yards. Well, that's well judged. Hole high, right inside the range. Putting for the big bird here. A birdie with big wings. Not a bad line, miss. Yep, you'll take that. Cannot imagine a better way to start their round off with an opening eagle. And after that hole, he's no longer sharing top spot. He's at the summit all alone. I'm pretty sure this player will be full of confidence now after that eagle back at the last hole. Downhill tee shot. You want to keep your tee shot out to the right as best you can to take out the trees that hug the left-hand side. Green sits well above the player's second shot. They won't see how close they hit it from the fairway. Do you like the view from where you're standing, Henny? This is looking around 115 yards out. Well, this one's going right at the flag. That was a beauty. And they've been rolling the ball great today. Another great look. So no change on the leaderboard for this player after that hole. Let's see what happens here at the third hole. That's tidy. Playing from around 160 yards. That's a pretty handy shot. Pay attention, folks. That's how you play golf. Just six feet between here and the hole. Looking for another birdie here. A wonderful putt. You can claim it. Back-to-back -back birdies. Two in a row there, Luke. Getting their groove on. He sits in first position. Now on the tee after a birdie. Fired up and ready for more. This is a challenging par three, no doubt about it, Luke. This green pitches from right to left and from front to back, making it almost impossible to get it super close unless you have a perfect number into this par three. Oh, this one's right down the pipe. That was a top effort, that one. So close to going down. This one's for birdie. Looks good. Oh, terrific. What an effort. Currently three strokes up after that hole.
Now on the tee, fresh off a of birdie, a great opportunity to build on that momentum. Second shot here on the fifth. Ah, great shot. Well, I like the way this person's playing. Birdies all over that scorecard. Always a good way to start. Let's see where they go from here. That one should find the surface. Oh, my. Right by the hole. Oh, this will be good for the momentum. Let's make this birdie putt. And maintaining top spot on the leaderboard after that. And they'd be feeling buoyed with confidence after that birdie. Here's a good chance to maintain the momentum. This is probably the hardest fairway to hit on the PGA Tour, Luke. This fairway cambers from right to left at a pretty good clip. And unless you work your tee shot from left to right, a high soft shot, you're not gonna find the fairway. This is almost impossible. The second shot will be from an awkward stance where the ball is above you or below you to a green that's perched a little bit above the players. Thankfully though, it's a very flat green. A wonderful shot, well played, a chance for Booty here at the sixth. A good opportunity here, just six feet to the hole. This is their look at birdie. Right over the spot they were looking at. And racking up their fifth birdie of the day. Our leader is currently enjoying a four-stroke advantage. Teeing off here at the seventh. You liked that, didn't you? Oh, what a gorgeous looking shot that is, Rich. Gee, I think they've got the handle of this game, Rich. Fairways and greens. Another green in regulation. This is an absolute clinic. Oh, these are good for the momentum, these ones. Right on eight feet. It's looking solid. Mark it down. That's six birdies today. Now, five shots up after that hole. Ooh, we're at the par three here. I love these holes. Wonderfully played. What have they got in front of them here, Henny? An uh, 18-footer here is what he's facing. Go on, get in the hole. 
Oh, what a round this is. Seven birdies today. And still in top spot after that hole. Keep it going. Setting up now on a par four. This is the second shot here on the ninth hole. This looks to be hit pretty well from where I'm standing. Oh, lovely looking shot into birdie range here at the ninth. And another one goes. And with it, an increase of his lead. Now that finds him in first place. And now we find ourselves with a par four here. Straight down the hill these tee shots go. That bunker down the left hand side should see a fair bit of action. If you leave it out to the right hand side there's some trees that are overhanging will block out your second shot. This green tilts pretty good from back to front. And taking aim from around 100 yards here. Chosen the pitching wedge here. That was special. All right, Henny. What's he got in front of him here with this putt? Firm back up the hill. This will be a good one. rolling end over end this putt's looking great well done take the birdie and with that hole behind us they're currently in the lead with tiger woods in second place love the long holes welcome to the par five This one's looking good off the tee. That should find the short stuff. This shot here from about 240 yards. Going with the five wood. Good sounding strike that one. That's not quite on the dance floor, Rich, but it's right up there near the green. A chance to perhaps pick up one, maybe two on this hole. What a sensational play on this par five there, Luke. And with that hole behind them, they currently lead ahead of Tiger Woods, who's second. The lead is getting bigger and bigger. Let's head to the 12th hole, shall we? Just a long iron or a hybrid for this tee shot here, Luke. Second shot, we're coming in with some kind of short iron to a green that's protected by a deep bunker in the front. This looks to be heading for the cut stuff. Super shot, that. Oh, beautiful touch there from just off the green. Nicely done. Well, that's certainly worth another look. Perfect distance, perfectly judged, and look at that. Straight in the hole.
So, still currently in the lead after that hole, but Tiger Woods is lurking in second place. Well, that's huge momentum there bringing to this hole. Coming off the eagle, time to hit another good drive. Luke, I've never seen a green in golf repel more golf balls than the 13th here at Innisbrook. It's like it's made out of Gore-Tex. Golf balls just don't stay on it. It is really one of the hardest shots at this Innisbrook golf course. Oh, that's a high caliber shot. What are we looking at for this putt, Henny? Well, he's got a real outside chance here, 29 feet. He's staring down a birdie putt here. Big chance here. Wonderful shot. Well, that's worth a replay. Let's take another look. They got their putting boots on here. Look at how this ball rolls end to end. Thing of beauty. Well, this player's mighty fine. Their lead is now nine after that performance. I'm pretty sure this player will be buoyed by that birdie back at the last. Let's see if they can deliver another one. Only the biggest hitters in the game can reach this one in two, so any tee shot just out to the right is ideal. That way it leaves an easier shot out to the left for your layup. The third shot will be going downhill to a green that tilts from back to front, guarded by a deep bunker over on the left-hand side. You find the fairway with your second shot, you've got a really good chance to hit your third in there close. Yeah, give yourself a pat on the back. Would it be nice to make this putt? This is for Regal. This is part of about six feet coming up. All right, guys, this for two birdies in a row. Just four feet remaining between him and the hole. This is looking solid, what they wanted. And three putting for par on this hole. And this is quality play, still on top of the leaderboard. Time to hit a good one here at the 15th. Looks to be going with the five iron. Well, they'd love a little bounce to the right here. Well, that's beautifully judged. A chance for a booty if this goes down. Surely it's going to. There it is. Managing to maintain their position on the leaderboard after that effort.
We've arrived at a par four. There's some trees over on the right hand side that you want to take it just left of to find the center of the fairway. From there, you're going to go in with a mid iron to a really small green. A high soft shot is required to hold this green. Nicely done. And Henny, what's he looking at here? He is right on the 150 yard marker here. This one is right down the pipe. That's a great shot here at 16. It sets up a chance for birdie. Six feet remaining to the cup. Little birdie look in here. Hang on, this looks pretty handy. That's a lovely putt to make for Birdie. Take some pride in that one. Gotta like it. Two in a row. And with that hole behind us, they're currently in the lead with Tiger Woods in second place. We have a par three on this one. The final challenging par three on this golf course. Good news is, though, is the green funnels in from both the right and left edges. Most shots are going to end up right in the center of this green. Oh, what a lovely shot. He'll be delighted to be inside the range there. What are we looking at for this putt, Henny? All right, down the hill here, got to be gentle. This really looks good. That will drop and it will extend the lead. Leading by a potentially insurmountable 11 strokes after that one. Not sure why I said potentially. Well, here we are. The 18th hole. Luke, this player coming off a birdie on the last hole. Getting some momentum going their direction. Good looking shot, this. From about 100 yards. Going with the pitching wedge here. Not a bad approach. Grab the putter from the caddy. You're dancing. Always love these opportunities, especially when it's for birdie. And that will do it for this player today.